Hi friends, it's Sue at A Call to Create. And I thought today I would show you um, the Rolodex that I have that I use both for Marguerite Miller type collaging and also um, some Bible, um, just keeping Bible verses or quotes that um, are meaningful to me. A while back, about a month or so ago, I did a video showing my craft area and uh, one of the uh, people who watched it asked about this Rolodex and, you know, have do, did I have a video uh, showing that? And I didn't, so I thought today I might just flip through it and uh, give you a look. Um, so the, this first section, is they're smaller, and um, I just use these for uh, general collaging. I use both sides. Some, oftentimes I try to get a little word on there. Um, so, yeah, I'll just flip through, you know, if there's something you want to look at um, a little more closely, you can always pause the video on your end. But, um, yeah, I, the thing I like about the Rolodex cards is it's such a small area to work in and um, very non-threatening it goes very quickly uh, so yeah it doesn't doesn't take a lot of time if you want to work on uh, two at a time you can do that sometimes I do uh, sometimes I just work on one side Okay, so those are the uh, Marguerite Miller collage type. Now, this one is just, these are a little bit bigger, and they are um, oftentimes, most of the time, quotes from the Bible that are, oops, that are meaningful to me. Oftentimes, I'm just cutting something out of a children's book or using up some... I, ha I punch these myself, so sometimes they they don't always flow the way I'd like, <laughs> as you can see. Um, this was, I think, during COVID. I put a little COVID uh, germs. Peace. Don't worry about it. <laughs> God's got this. Sometimes I just uh, have a little scrap of something from somewhere and it gives me uh, an idea about uh, what scripture might work there. Or other times I start with the scripture and then try to find something that would work with it. Though the mountains may fall. Okay. Most of these are on one side. I think I went back and at some point and started working on the second side. So, yeah, as you can see, most of these are scriptures. Some every once in a while, I'll come across a quote from a saint or. Um, I think there's a C.S. Lewis one in here as well, St. Augustine. Or a topic such as greed. You know, something, this is just from a magazine, a floral magazine, I think, or something that where you could buy the seeds or the bulbs. So I just cut that out and uh, put it in. Most of the time, they're just little scraps. Maybe a little something from a magazine. This was just an old something I had. Um, it was like a journaling card, you know, for Bible journaling. I used to do a lot of that, and so I still have a lot of digital downloads and 
things that I have left. I always loved this one. This was hysterical. A little sarcasm in, in there. If you have <laughs> First Kings 18, 27 to 29, go look that up. That's it's pretty funny if you have a dark side to you. They're fine. I, I, you know, they're fun to do because they're short, they're quick, and you know, every so often you just want to go through and read these because, you know, they're good. We're, and then, yeah, here I was starting to do, I think, the other side of some of these. So I'll have to go back and and start working on the second side of of these although i still have plenty of room in here uh, to do more if i want so anyway that's that i hope you enjoyed it and um yeah so thanks for coming along and watching and if you don't mind hitting the like button i would appreciate it take care see you next time